just guys, this is Nilly Lanston and welcome. In this video, what we're going to be talking about is the perk anti-up and whether it's actually any good at all. Now, as we know, with anti-up, it gives you a little bit of a start and bonus towards getting your score streaks. Now, with my score streaks, as you're seeing on the right-hand side of the screen, I'm running with the Dart, the Hellstorm Missile, and the Talon. Now, this particular gameplay is going to highlight a couple of little points about anti-up and my problems with it. Now, I have used anti-up quite a lot. I have got the calling card for it. I've done the challenge where you have to earn 200 score streaks using anti-up in this particular game. And even after that, I've got to be honest here, I did not even notice that I was running with it. It's pretty, pretty useless in my particular eyes. As you see in here, I do get caught out. But even with that little run, even with collecting all those tags and having anti-up, I still did not get up to dart, not whatsoever. So even then, it's a bit disappointing. In this particular instance, I am going to go on a bit of a run. Now, as soon as I get past my talent and whatnot else, I'd have earned those points easily without actually using anti-up. Now, let's look at the perk two slot category. Now, what you're going to be replacing this with, you're running with anti-up instead of fast hands. Now, fast hands is a pretty much one of those kind of gimmies that you really want to be using, especially if you're an aggressive kind of player. I mean, fast hands will help you out in gunfights, and especially in particular lives, anti-up gives you 200 points. I can promise you now, fast hands will give you more than 200 points in one life straight away. Yes, you can come back and say that maybe you could chuck a wild card on, use fast hands or scavenger or uh, cold-blooded or something like that, and run anti-up at the same time but would you really want to waste a wild card and an extra perk slot just on this because I can promise you one thing if you wanted to use a wild card get you some extra perks I would definitely be running with like uh, dead silence and awareness at the same time that will definitely buy you an extra 200 points and more in one particular life straight away so for me in particular I would strafe away for it. I don't see too many people using it, but I have seen some people using it. And I will promise you now it will cost you more lives than what it will put those 200 points extra on the screen for you. So for me in general, I would definitely strafe away from anti-up. I would use your perk slot for definitely like maybe fast hands, maybe scavenger, depending on what kind of class setup and what weapon that you're actually particularly using. But anti-up, guys, it really is not worth those 200 points whatsoever. But leave it in the comment section below, guys, exactly what you're thinking about this. Be very, very interested here because I know people will have different views, but this is my opinion on the perk anti-up. But leave everything in the comment section below. But coming up on my screen now is my subscribe button. Make sure you're jumping on that. Got lots more things coming up on Black Ops 3. And make sure you're dropping a like on this video and supporting me, guys. This is Nilly Lassenov. Catch you later.